I agree. I think there's a lot of ways to prioritize, but I think what's most effective is identifying tasks that people don't like doing. <laughs> so, you know, daily jobs are routines that, that no one wants to do, but they have to. Um, so kind of looking at those types of pain points um, are going to have the biggest reward because people are going to want to adopt the AI, right? They're going to want to use it. So when we look in the video space, um, a lot of people sit in front of cameras. That's all they do. They watch them 24-7. It's not fun. <laughs> it's tedious. Um, it's boring. It's easy to miss something. Um, but it's also critical to be there watching, right? So you know, there's, there's kind of high value in automating this. Um, and it's something that people are going to be open to. You know, somebody's going to want that assistant to help them do it. They're not ready to be replaced by the machine, but they're certainly ready for help. So I think anything that people honestly just don't want to do, <laughs> um, and that's going to be the lowest um, friction point. There's not going to be resistance. Um, and they also want to think about you know, not going for the full solution. Right? It can be incremental. It can be you know, little things that help the workforce um, and you know, kind of gradually become stronger or more present over time.